My name is Detective Schwamm. I'm here to solve the murder of Waldo. So, this is the victim. Yes, we found Mr. Waldo here, with these scissors lodged in his abdomen. I see. Are there any suspects? Yes, there are three. The first suspect is Miss Waldo, the victim's widow. Mrs. Waldo? Yes? Are you alright? Oh yes, my heel broke earlier tonight. I see. I'm very sorry for your loss of it. Can you tell me anything else that happened? Well, what happened was... Now that I'd questioned the wife, it was time to visit Mr. Waldo's estranged brother, Walton. Good day. I'm Inspector Schwamm. Are you Mr. Walden's brother? Yes, I am. Can you tell me what happened at the party? It's really just a shame because, well, my, my brother and I just started becoming friends after some stuff that we had gone through. And I, I don't know. I, I don't know what happened. I mean, if I was running late for the party, and whenever I got here... The first two stories are very similar. Time I paid Consuela the maid a visit. Ah, oh, I see. You're Consuela, the uh, maid. See, si, Consuela. Ah, Miss Consuela, could you tell me your version of what happened earlier? Well, I was about to retire to my room for the night when. How can I tell who's lying? Their stories were so similar. But I knew someone had to be lying. I just couldn't figure out who it was. It just doesn't add up! Hello, this is Betty Studebaker with Forensic. Ah yes, Betty. You have any leads? Not quite. But we did find that the scissors were inserted post-mortem. You see, the actual cause of death was blunt force trauma to the head. The murder weapon would have to be something like a metal rod or a... Or the heel of a high heel shoe. I have to go. You're not going anywhere.